Hello everyone, this is Running On Empty Food Review. Well, hello ladies and gentlemen and everyone watching. This is Running On Empty Food Review. I am your host, the Report of the Week, and welcome to this newest, uh, newest review, newest edition of Running On Empty, the Food Review. Going with a uh, very serious opening for uh, a very serious release. Not really. I'm just saying that, but uh, well, it's, I guess I guess the intro's over. Let's just get into the uh, <laughs> the, the meat of things. Uh, this is a uh, fairly new item from uh, Papa John's, and uh, you know it's it's kind of funny how it is, because y you know <clears throat> you had Pizza Hut a little while ago. You know it wasn't it wasn't ages ago, but it was a little while ago. Pizza Hut released their um, mozzarella poppers. Uh, pizza. Papa John's is getting in on the action, if you catch my drift. This isn't a pizza, you know? If it is, it would be a, uh, either a small pizza, or they really found a way to condense, you know, pizza in a small box, which is possible, you know? I've seen it done. I have. I have. It's an experimental procedure, but it could still be done. Um, but instead, this is like a sign. This is like a, um... You know, it's like an appetizer. It could be an appetizer. It could be a side. If you're feeling really daring, you can make it a dessert. Not recommended, but you can if you want to. I mean, you know, it's it's. If you get it, it's your item. Do whatever you want with it. You know, make it into an earring and, and wear it. You know, as like a decorative uh, item or as a lapel pin or something. If you really want to, but you're supposed to eat it. Jalapeno poppers rolls from Papa John's. The uh, jalapeno poppers rolls. Uh, they're pretty simple, right? They're like jalapeno poppers, but they're done the popper John's way. Get it? The popper poppers joke. Uh, what these come with is a Philadelphia cream cheese. Um, they uh, also come with... Uh, they're made out of, like, their pizza dough, their original dough. They're baked. They uh, come with a ranch dip, and it's got a uh, jalapeno in it. It's supposed to be a little cheesy, a little spicy, and, uh, it's like a, well, I guess it's a jalapeno popper, or poppers, roll, uh, for $5.99 for a box of them. Pretty simple, pretty simple item, but jalapeno poppers, I've always liked those items. Always liked them, always been a fan of them, and uh, we'll see how good Papa John's does them this time around. And here they are again in the, uh, the little mini, the mini box right there, you can see. What does the box say? Papa John's, the pizza... Okay, so this is like a mini version of the, um... Okay. Crafted from California tomatoes that go from vine to can in the same day. Those aren't talking about the, um... Jalapenos are talking about tomatoes. Alright, well, good enough. Small little box. Let's open the box and let's see, uh... There they are. There they are. Right there. Got the, uh, got the money shot. Here we go. They're small. You know what? They're cute. I got, you know, I got to give them credit. Let's get the auto focus off so you can get a better look at them. I don't know. Isn't that thing kind of cute? It's so small. It's like it's a little. It's like it's a little. This is this is where pizzas come from. If you ever wanted to know where they come from, this is it right here. These are like little mini, you know, baby pizzas. Not really. That's like a horrible analogy, but we'll just go with it. But I mean, you can see there's the close-up. You can see the jalapeno kind of lurking out with the cheese inside, and otherwise it's wrapped in the uh, dough. Sorry about any background noise, but you could say it adds to the uh, ambiance, right? Because this, um... There's a background noise just screams jalapeno poppers, right? <laughs> uh, it does come with the ranch dipping sauce, so that's what it usually comes with right there. And, uh, let's see how many come in a box, because they didn't really say. Let's do a, um, head count. I guess a roll count, right? Because this would be the roll. What do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think it's eight. Two, four, six, eight. Yep. All right, so eight in a box right there. Eight little um, poppers. Let's give it a shot. There it is once again. We'll just try it out. Then I'll try it out with the uh, ranch dipping sauce, and we'll see uh, how it tastes. Jalapeno poppers rolls from Papa John's going in. Hmm. 
<laughs> Take a little bit of a um, bite out of this one while we're at it. Since they're so they're, they're so small, you know, as, as it is. It's Here's an observation that I have on the jalapeno poppers. And, um, number one, the spiciness of these really is jalapeno face. <clears throat> as, as I meant to say, it's very pronounced, right? <laughs> the spiciness of the jalapenos is very pronounced. <laughs> I, I, I couldn't look I couldn't resist making that joke right there <laughs> but here here's the truth when it comes down to these though there's there's two observations one is good one isn't the best um, number one if you're getting these for the jalapeno uh, flavor right you are in luck uh, these are spicy I mean actually I've been trying to fend off the urge to guzzle down some water but I can't I, I, got, I got to Yeah, if you're getting these for that spiciness, for the jalapeno peppers, I mean, you're in luck. Um, because these are spicy. These are much uh, spicier than one I, I anticipated. You know, because sometimes you get these items that are like, right, they say it's the world's uh, hottest and deadliest pepper or something. And, you know, when you actually try it, you're not going to keel over from it, right? Might be a little spicy, but it's nothing like what they say it's going to be like. Uh, these, on the other hand, yeah, they're spicy, all right. Much spicier than you'd think. Uh, I mean, it's a lingering spice, too. I mean, it's going to be there for a while. It's still there. Um, definitely not the hottest, but those those jalapeno peppers, they come out swinging. I'll tell you that. So, uh, number one, yeah, very, very intense. Um, intense heat from it, which is a good thing. Though. You want to get these to be spicy, right? That's the whole reason you're getting these. My only complaint, maybe they're a little, a little more doughy. Well... Yeah, the doughiness is a little, you know, it's iffy. My biggest thing, though, isn't even the doughiness. It's that they say it's the jalapeno poppers with that jalapeno pepper and then the Philadelphia cream cheese. And when you see the ads, when you see the pictures, right, it's like you see the, the tons of jalapenos, but it's also like they're oozing with cheese. Like, it's just pouring out like, um you know, Niagara Falls, right? It's just like it's 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 flowing out nonstop. Um, and, you know, by the time, like, you would have a mountain of the cheese that had had come out of this thing, right? Um, but as I, as I ate these, there really wasn't a lot of cheese. I mean, there was a little bit, but not as much as I would have expected, but there were a lot more jalapeno peppers. Could be a bit more cheesy, you know, the, the cream cheese. I mean, it's kind of there, but I really can't taste the cheese. I wish there was more cheesiness. There wasn't even enough that I could really discern, like, an actual, you know, flavor from it. Really, I could just taste the dough, and oh boy, can I taste those uh, jalapeno peppers. Um, but I wish they were a bit cheesier, but I think for many a consumer, it would be like, you're getting these for the spice, and then the cheese is secondary, right? It's not, it's not why you're getting it. You're not saying, yeah, I want the jalapeno poppers, but I want it really for that, that cream cheese, right? Because that's just what I've been dreaming about all night. We'll try it with the uh, ranch dipping sauce. I think some sauce could help them a little bit, but we'll find out. Try this one out. Dip it in real quick. Price for these, $5.99. There it is with the dip. Mm-hmm. So, you know, I'll show you. Right, like, you look in there. You see a little bit of the cream cheese, but there's not a lot. Just a little, maybe a little smattering, but nothing more than that.
The ranch is a uh, suitable companion, <clears throat> I would definitely say, because it it gives it some more moisture. I do like that that little that little subtle tang that it has that kind of offsets just the doughiness and just that the overall spiciness. I think the ranch is especially good though if you're a little more sensitive to spice, um, but you don't really you know you want to get a little bit of that jalapeno flavor. You don't want it to be overwhelming, right? Ranch kind of cools things down a little bit. So, uh, I mean, with that said, out of 10, you know, for $5.99, I really like the, the, the punch that it packs in terms of the spice. I mean, I'm a, I'm a big fan of that. I just wish they were a little, a little cheesier. So, uh, out of 10, I'll give them a, a 5.8 out of 10, uh, which is above average. The scale that I use, now your 5 is uh, average, of course. So, 5.8, a little above average, because I really do like the spice. If they were a little cheesier, they would get a much higher rating. Um... But if you're just getting these exclusively for that spice, uh, you're going to like them. You'll be a big fan of them. $5.99 jalapeno poppers rolls from Papa John's. I think they're good, though, and, um, yeah, just, uh, you know, be, be ready. They'll be, they'll be spicy. They'll pack a punch for sure. With that, I'm your host, The Report of the Week. Sorry for the uh, little bit of a delay between uh, getting the last video with the uh, donut thing and uh, this one out. But uh, here we are. Uh, just on a final note, a little bit of a uh, PSA. Uh, I know you've probably heard about this so much, and uh, I've been talking about this a lot as well. Um, but the virus, I I think it's serious. You know, you just have to be you have to be careful. Hygiene is very important, and uh, just make sure you exercise proper hygiene. Take care of yourself, you know, just be aware of your your surroundings, your situation. Try not to touch your eyes, you know. Uh, maybe pretend like. You just ate a bunch of these and you have the jalapeno remnants all over your fingers. You don't want to rub your eyes with that, right? So, uh, you know, just, just be wary. Try not to touch your eyes, your nose. Uh, you know, if you have a thing for licking doorknobs or something, just, I, would, I would break that habit if I were you. But wash your hands, 20 seconds uh, at least. Uh, good soap and water, maybe some hand sanitizer too. And uh, just keep up to date with um, reputable news information about this. But please be safe. I really care about your well-being for each and every one of you. And uh, just stay safe out there. I'm your host of the Report of the Week. Thank you for watching today's review. And uh, I'll see you later with uh, another video. Take care, everyone.